Looks like this is a case of shutting the stable door after the horse has bolted. Well, with the widespread destruction caused by the massive fireworks explosions at Supanburi's Dragon Park on Tuesday, fair organizers across the country will no doubt have to sit up and strictly follow safety precautions to prevent such a horror from repeating itself. 500 people were abruptly made homeless after their homes were burned in the resulting fire during Chinese New Year celebrations. The explosions destroyed every structure within a 4-kilometer radius, while the death toll stood at 4 people, including 3 fireworks workers. The number of injured shot up to 74. Interior Minister Yong Yud Vichai Did has already made it clear that he is not going to ban fireworks displays and who's to blame him? Fireworks, he maintained, do indeed add color and sparkle to celebrations. Still, since fireworks are nothing short of explosive devices made of dynamite, they can become powerful killers. But from now on, Yong Yu stated, provincial governors will be instructed to make fair organizers follow strict guidelines when organizing any event in public areas to prevent serious mishaps like the incident in Supanburi. Young youth, of course, jumped to the defense of the high-ranking officials involved in organizing the Supanburi event, saying the explosion was an accident caused by the workers in charge of setting off the fireworks. Although an investigation into the accident is still to be completed, Yong Yu said he was informed that the inappropriate angle of the fireworks cylinders triggered the accident. If the workers had the sense to place the cylinders upright without any of them tilting, the accident would not have happened.